You guys, we are in quarantine. You heard it. Ciao. Everybody in my house has been sick. So now I'm I'm the last one to get hit. <laughs> I'm just sipping on some echinacea tea mixed with some green ginger tea. Green tea and ginger. And I'm gonna try to talk as loud as I can because my throat is a little sore right now. But everybody has been getting sick lately. First, it started with Carmen, my oldest. She got sick the day after Christmas. Well, first of all, Happy New Year's. Okay, it may not be a Happy New Year, but we're blessed to see another year. So, welcome back to another vlog, you guys. Today is gonna be my quarantine vlog because we are not getting out of this house. We are not doing much of anything. I did want to talk to you guys because I am currently sick at the moment. The other kids are not sick anymore. So pretty much I'm going to treat it as if it was COVID. I have not gotten tested. I don't even want to leave the house at this point. So I had my mom get Zora because Zora, she's three and she likes to be up under me all the time and I just can't do it. So I didn't want it to be a thing where we're all just passing it back and forth. You know, I'm trying to clean the house and I can't do that. If you if you guys have toddlers or young children, you understand that they like to just be up under you all the time and it's very hard to recover and get better if you're trying to tend to babies and little kids. So with Carmen, Carmen is older, so she knows, okay, put your mask on, stay on the other side of the house. We're in quarantine. She understands what it is. So yeah, um, I'm gonna be putting this mask on for the time being because I do wanna let this sit. I'm using a the African black soap clarifying mud mask. I use this mask all the time, but I'm running out. I have like enough to do literally one more face mask. So I want to kind of um, just do a little self care today because I haven't been able to do that lately. I've been, as far as my symptoms, I've been having a sore throat. I've been having body aches. My body has been aching, so it's been hard for me to sleep at night mainly like in the middle of my back, like the upper middle of my back. And my arm was like sore today, but that was weird. I think I might have just slept on it wrong. That tea is still hot. You can still see it smoking a little bit. But um, yeah, I've been having some body aches. I had like diarrhea one day. I know that's like <laughs> TMI, y'all, but this is this is a real deal, authentic, keeping it 100 with y'all. Yeah, I had that one day. Um, it was pretty painful for a little bit. And then after that, I was good. I've been eating, like, I've been eating soups. I haven't been eating, like, solid foods. The other day I had breakfast, but ever since I had, um, ever since that day I had breakfast, I haven't eaten, like, food food. I've just been eating, like, um, I've just been drinking my smoothies. So I've been making my smoothies, and my smoothies have been satisfying my hunger, so... I haven't lost my appetite. So really, it's just been those symptoms. It's like one day I'll have a sore throat, the next day I won't. So today is the third day, so that's pretty weird. The body aches, I've had the body aches the whole entire time. <sighs> I've had a little cough, but nothing major. Um, I haven't, my nose hasn't been stopped up or anything. It hasn't been hard for me to breathe. I still can taste, still can smell. Um, it doesn't feel like the flu. It actually feels better than the flu, if that makes any sense. Because the flu, when I had the flu, honey, I was going through it. The flu had me out. I had no appetite. I wasn't trying to do nothing. I couldn't move around. Like, I can move around. I can clean. I can do that right now. So, yeah, those are the symptoms that I've been having. And I'm just quarantining just to be safe. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
and I don't want to jeopardize anybody else getting sick because I'm waiting to get a test or however it works. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'd rather just sit home, quarantine, and try to just get through it because that's what I'm going to have to do regardless. So, yeah, let's go get some chicken noodle soup. I think I'm going to take me a, um, I'm going to soak in some Epsom salt later. But I do want to try to make this little concoction. Ooh, that is very sour. So I'm going to add some honey to it. Okay, that's better. I can definitely taste the ginger. It's very strong. So I'm gonna be sipping on this. If you guys make this, make sure you add honey to it so it's not so sour. All right, you guys, that is the end of this video. I'm going to take my soup and my little smoothie concoction and I'm going to call it a night. So thank you guys for tuning in and I will see you in the next one.